great news to report today on the massive Pine Gulch fire. Fire officials say Colorado's second largest fire in history was stable overnight. The blaze has currently burned almost 136,000 acres, which is an increase of about 1,000 acres from yesterday. But the fire team still has 47% of the fire contained. Our Krista Spatacini is live near Grand Junction Regional Airport to tell us more. Krista? That's right, Rob. If you look behind me, the sky is clearer than it has been over the last week. You can see the mountain and above the mountain. That is a cloud. That is not smoke. That is because the fire team told me that there has been less expansion of the fire due to the high humidity at night. But do not get too excited because the fire officials did say that the Pine Gulch fire is still growing in the north side of the book cliffs. The Pine Gulch fire has burned through the book cliffs for about a month now, and firefighters are all over the mountains trying to stop the spread. The fire team says there is zero potential for movement in the east, and there's minimal movement in the south. And there's a lot of um, very light vegetation, a lot of rock in here, natural boundaries. They're going to limit fire spread to the south. Firefighters are working 24 hours a day, seven days a week, to contain the flames. And we're getting more containment lines in where we're, we're able to stop the, um, the, the, the growth of it. We still have areas though where the, where the fire is growing and still potential for it to grow more. The fire team is keeping a close eye on the western side of the mountain and is most concerned with the north side. Here's where we've had most of our fire activity and our top priority on the fire right now is right in this area. Here the flames are in a tough spot so firefighters must be cautious. It was hard for us to safely engage it and it's it's down out now. Another challenge the fire team may encounter deals with the potential thunderstorms in the forecast. And a fire official says the storms are a mixed blessing. Uh, bring the risk of more lightning and, and having more starts in the area that we have to respond to. And, but then also um, we might get a little bit of rain and a little bit of increase in humidity and that can help uh, lessen the fire activity. He also says the unpredictable wind patterns can cause some problems, but the thunderstorms will be on every fire member's radar. A fire official said that even though the fire conditions are stable and the smoke isn't as thick today, the Pine Gulch fire is still actively burning. So there, uh, so it is not unusual for there to be some visible smoke in the Grand Valley until there is a season ending weather event like some rainfall or some snow. Uh, until then, though, we will have more up, more updates on the Pine Gulch fire as they become available. And first on the Western Slope and live near Grand Junction Regional Airport, I'm Chris Spadaccini for KREX 5 News. Rob. Thanks, Krista. And we